hello, this is Pietro again. This, this time I will try to entertain you on, uh, on creativity. There is a very nice Italian saying uh, stating that uh, nobody is born uh, um, knowledgeable. I would, I would expand a little bit this, this saying, saying no born is, is, nobody is born creative. Let's say that there are people that have more attitude than, than others, of course, but uh, creativity is, uh, is a process that requires a lot of, uh, let's say, uh, dedication, uh, requires a lot of uh, error, requires a lot of study because creativity without uh, scientific knowledge has uh, lots of limitation, okay? Uh, creativity is also a form of happiness because once you create something which is different, uh, you, you feel happy. So, so I'm only uh, encouraging everybody to go in this direction. But let me return to the point. Uh, creativity is experience on making errors and trying and trying to challenge what it is uh, the status quo, okay? Uh, acquiring data, acquiring different knowledge with the purpose to uh, generate something different. And here comes the point. Some years ago, when I was uh, getting my degree in, in artificial intelligence from, uh, from MIT, so it was not that many years ago, um, many, many professors teaching artificial intelligence were convinced that uh, at the end, uh, the artificial intelligence could not reach the creativity of humans. Things today have changed dramatically. Only few people that do not really understand what artificial intelligence is doing think that creativity is a human characteristics. Uh, because if you look at how artificial intelligence uh, evolves, it's based on data, it's based on, it's based on experience, it's based on the fact that you, you say, hey, this is wrong. You have to change. Uh, but they collect so many data. They collect my experience and the experience of millions of people. They collect the errors that millions of people have made in the years. They collect the intelligence of millions of people all at the same time, and they put it as, as their knowledge, no doubt. The creativity of the machine will be much, much, much better than what the most creative person will be. Because the computational power, the memory, and the, all the knowledge acquired by artificial, intelli the artificial intelligence it, devices will be so much more than what humans can, can do that uh, the future of the creative people is still there at the condition that uh, their interaction with the machine will uh, grow and grow and grow. So if I can give a suggestion to, to everybody, work more and more with the machines because if you really want to discriminate the challenge of the status quo more than what the other are doing, then you have to work with the new, new machines. Hoping that the machine will not decide one day that you are needless for his own creativity. Hope you understood what I'm saying. <laughs>